Hi team, this is level three and four, combo two defense. So Jack is gonna attack me with a combination and I'm gonna defend this combination. This is what it looks like fast. Just like that. And I do the combo at him. Just like that, okay? So when Jack attacks me, I'm gonna parry first. When I parry, my left hand goes to my cheek. If I'm an attacking guard, my left hand goes to the cheek. As the right hand goes out and back to the cheek. And your hand wants to be open, so you're using the palm to parry away rather than your fist being tired. Relax as you parry. Bring your hand straight back to your cheek. Now I'm ready to defend that body hook. And I lean forwards into the side rather than back into the side like this where I'm not going to be able to count back. If I'm here and he tries to attack with any other shots, I'm able to just to protect myself, keeping everything tight, and then I can start countering back. So after this cover here, with this hand on your cheek, I'm going to throw the left hook and then be in that front cover. Rather than in your body upright, check that you're leaning forwards, tensing up your core, and blocking here with the other hand on your cheek and your hands not coming up too high, you're putting this on your forehead. From there, as you slide back, keep those hands up, because that can keep coming fast, and then you can be still sliding back a little more, but for the scissor kick, all you're gonna do is bring your hand up just slightly to protect yourself, okay? Because a lot of times when we're, we're being attacked with kicks, we might just be blocking like this, but when I can see a kick come into my body with more power with the shin, I'm gonna double cover like this, and that's where I can be countering back. So this hand is providing extra cushion for the shin coming in um, to your body. So one last time, Jack slides in one of our toes, moving around, and we're parrying here. As soon as I've done the parry, I'm gonna make sure that's strong and bring it back to my cheek. And then I see that he's throwing that body hook, so I'm gonna protect my body. Keep both hands up when you do the body hook, and check you're bending your knees, and your weights on the balls of your feet and counter with the left hook, bringing that hand straight back. So that would be a good time for your sparring partner, for Jack to, when he bottom weaves, to throw a cross straight away. And that's maybe, if you're a bit lazy with bringing your hands back, you might expose yourself to a shot there. So I have to throw the hook and bring my hand straight back so I can protect myself with the front cover of that cross. Slide back, double cover, and then bring that hand up for the scissor, round ass kick on the end. Okay, I'll do that for Jack here. He's gonna parry first of all, and bring his hand straight back to block, and he's leaning forwards into the side, remember? Yeah, you're not dropping your hand, keep your hand on your cheek, and it's more about bending your legs and using your abdominals and your obliques to block versus moving your arm, okay? I don't need to move my arm at all, it's more about the legs, and my abdominals and obliques, okay? From there, he counters, and then he does that front cover. His other hand's up. Always keep your chin down and look for your eyebrows. He slides back, kick, kick, and he just needs to bring that hand up for that scissor round kick on the end. So that's combo two defense team. Keep practicing that, and we look forward to strike testing you.